Hey everyone, Lynn Schrader coming at you from my office today. Uh, you can see my chalkboard behind me. Uh, I used to be a teacher, for those of you that don't know. So um, once a teacher, always a teacher. I don't teach in the classroom anymore, but I do coach and train people to take their business to the next level, to be very successful in their business. And I also coach people on mindset, confidence, belief in themselves, having, uh, finding out their purpose, their passion, and chasing those dreams. And today, I want to talk to you about resistance training. Um, I love to tell you guys stories about things that have happened in my life and how I change them into a story, a life lesson, and usually, I cross my fingers. Usually these are stories that I can help with the people that I'm coaching to sort of get them past a mindset that's that's holding them back. So today I want to talk to you about resistance training. Uh, those of you that know me know that I love to work out. Um, I'm passionate about the gym. Um, I'm passionate about physical fitness. Been working out in the gym. Um, been working been making a habit of going to the gym for years and years and years and years and I'm completely embracing the idea that we get one body, one body in this world and we have to make it last for a lifetime, right? It's a no-brainer, right? But we've got to take care of it and we've got to do things that make it stronger so that when we are called to do things, when we're called to chase our purpose, our passion, our, our vision, our dreams, uh, take our businesses to the next level, be a good parent, be a good friend, whatever it is, you gotta feel good about yourselves. So, resistance training. Resistance training is um, helps your muscles. It hel actually helps muscle tone. It helps uh, your bones. It helps your cardiovascular system and my trainer Kevin out there if he's on watching this or if he watches this um, at some point maybe he can uh, you know give a better explanation but certainly resistance training is great for your muscles uh, not only does it tone them but it's going to be great to, to uh, help with your your bones so that you're not stooped over as you're older and things like that and great for your cardiovascular system like I said earlier but resistance training is also good for us personally when you take the physical fitness side of that term away and you think about when we are called to step out of our comfort zone and do things that are a little bit out of the norm, out of our self-imposed comfort zone, that is resistance training. So many times we can plan our future in our head, but when it's time to actually do it, we experience resistance and we decide to just wait to see what happens. Instead of really making those plans come true, we decide to just, oh, let's, I'll just wait to see what happens. And there's, the, there's this pull, there's this resistance in that. Not only are we um, shirking resistance, but we're also in the middle of this resistance. We know what we want, but it's getting there that, we, that, that stops us. So there's that resistance. It's like we're living between two worlds um, and it's this tension, it's this resistance. So, you know, five, six, seven years ago, I decided that I was not going to just settle for the norm. I was going to leave some mindsets behind and start making my future happen. And that was that I was not going to feel guilty about certain things. Um, that meant that I was not going to necessarily uh, say yes to everything. That meant that I was going to step out of my comfort zone and do things that were fearful to me. Uh, that means I was not going to stop putting things off like we're so apt to do when we're afraid to do things. That meant that I was not going to be sucked in to people in my life that were sort of use the passive aggressive um, 
method with me. I was going to be aware of that and I was going to say no. I was doing resistance training. I was making my muscles stronger in my head so that I could step out of my comfort zone. You know, nobody can stop you from living an extraordinary life unless it's you. You're the only one that's stopping you from creating this extraordinary life, from doing things that don't feel good, from resisting things that are the norm, for deciding that you're not going to um, uh, just be uh, mediocre anymore. You're going to do some things that are extraordinary. Ordinary. There's a quote that I heard and I love it. I actually have it written on my chalkboard. That chalkboard's just filled with all kinds of things to, um, to work on mindsets. But what it is, is it says, the path of least resistance is the path of a loser. Wow. That's from H.G. H. G. Wells. If you didn't know that, I think he did, uh, what, 1984 or something like that. But that's a heavy quote. I'll say it again. The path of least, of least resistance, the path of least resistance is the path of a loser. Wow. And that was me. That was me years ago when I just wanted to stay within my comfort zone, when I just wanted to color inside of the lines because I knew that's where it was safe. But when I stepped out and I did things that were made me fearful, that I, I, uh, I, I didn't do things, I wasn't a people pleaser all the time. Who out there is a people pleaser? Well, resistance training is deciding that you're not gonna be a people pleaser anymore. You're gonna be kind, but you're gonna do things not to just not make waves. So that's my lesson today. That's my video today, and it's all about resistance training. Get yourself some muscles. Build up those resistance muscles. Um, you know, character is built. Muscles are built in the gym through resistance, but our character and our mindset and our resiliency and our decision to take our life to the next level, to be very present and, and, and understand where we're going, that is resistance training as well because it builds character. So don't take the path of least resistance because that's the losing path. Take the path that's gonna have, gonna make you step out of your comfort zone and live to tell about it. All right, thanks for watching today. Listen, super excited again. I need you guys to know that my website will go live in about a week. And on that website is blogs that I've written, videos like this that I've done. Um, I have trained thousands of people on uh, mindset, uh, behaviors, confidence, finding their purpose, believing in themselves, confidence. And that's what I'll have on the website. I'll also have tips, tricks, strategies, systems that I've used to become very successful in my own business. And lastly, I'll have some uh, things on there for um, fitness, wellness. So I, I would love for you to visit my site and be the first one to know when those uh, some free video series are gonna come out. And, um, and lots of other things that I'm sure will be beneficial for you, to you. I'm all about paying it forward, just like those that have come into my life and coached and trained me. And by the way, all my things that I coach and train on are, are, are grounded in, in tried and true things. They're not just my opinions. So visit my website. I'll go ahead and I'll put it in the comment section below. I welcome your comments below and I certainly welcome you sharing this with people that are in your world that might need to, to view it. Uh, have a great day, pay it forward, and uh, get your resistance training going. Thank you guys.